if you're looking at a, an, any issue purely kind of statistically, um, you know, looking at it on a database or w with one lens, you always risk missing something and in particular you miss meaning and what a place means to a community and I think they have missed the meaning here you know both in ethereal kind of um, community you know memory type terms and in actual kind of biodiversity value which is absolutely critical at the moment um, and critical to our futures um, you know, blocking a wildlife corridor in the middle of a climate emergency and in the middle of a biodiversity crisis is an absolutely crazy thing to do even on paper um, you know in, in addition to you know anything around um, you know the costs of this don't make sense either so this isn't really a project that seems to make sense rationally except perhaps if you're looking just from the point of view of wanting to be rid of responsibility for something um, but I suppose National highways have also been charged with the responsibility for stewardship of our railway heritage and what I really really hope they will begin to kind of open their eyes to is not that these structures are a burden and a risk and a liability for them but that actually it's an honour to be looking after our railway heritage. It's something really precious and interwoven into the history of our country and I really hope you know, they will start to kind of recognise the, the privilege that they have of looking after these structures and the responsibility for, for careful stewardship that starts to recognise that actually these, these may be historic structures, but they have a place in our hearts and a role in our future.